All right, so now time to see what DVDs are in this bag. So this movie looks like it could be like Christine. Uh, there's been some other movies too that have been made that have to do with, uh, you know, um, like Hybrid Car was one that have to do with possessed or uh, um, haunted uh, vehicles. Well, this one, I mean, hey, you know, uh, it looks interesting. Uh, some people consider this a sequel or just a complete remake of uh, of Alien vs. Predator. Uh, this show is just great. I, I really enjoy it. I can't wait to see this uh, season two. It's what we got here. So um, the original, The Magnificent Seven with Steve McQueen. I've always heard this guy's a really good actor. I got to check it out to finally see what's up with this. And, uh, and I'll, I'll plan, plan on rating it amongst the uh, best Westerns, like a Top Gun, low budget film. Uh, I've never seen it. Uh, we'll see. We'll see if I do see it. I mean, I have so many movies that, that I want to see, but I, I plan on giving everybody, giving all these a shot. I wasn't crazy about Mind, Mind of Mencia, uh, but here we go. Uncensored season three and uncensored season four. Um, Batman Begins. I remember watching it, and I just remember the training part of Chris, you know, Christian Bale, kind of like where he trains, how he becomes Batman. I don't remember the Scarecrow standing out too much, so I, I think I need to give it another gander. Always heard about it, never seen it, um, and, I, and I will, like I said, I'll give it a chance, just like all these other films. Um, but after if they're not good after 10 minutes, then I'm not going to keep watching. An extended cut. Uh, I never saw the the regular, you know, theatrical version. Um, so I, I plan on seeing this one and just checking out and then seeing how it is. You know, we'll, we'll see how The Rock does. And I've been curious about it, so um, I think it was it was meant to be. And, uh, and so I definitely this has this has to be one of the first films I checked out from this bag. Uh, Jumper, um, just give it a chance because uh, I mean, let's be honest. I've seen I've seen worse acting. The game plan. Oh, I gotta check it out. Uh, see if it's see if it uh, holds up to some of the uh, football greats like Rudy and uh, and. Um, uh, remember the titans edge of darkness with mel gibson i remember when this came out uh when it first came out and I, we, we rented it from probably Redbox, i believe and then um and now i have it now i own it i'm proud to say i own it because it's a good movie uh more than you know, this baldwin everybody knows he's the harry baldwin uh it's complicated it looks like things get hairy here and um and complicated so we gotta watch this i'm gonna check out this movie see how complicated it is forgetting sarah marshall one of my favorite comedies of all time I definitely recommend it. House by the Cemetery by Lucio Fulci or Fulci, Fuki, no Fusi, Fulci. I think pretty scary. I mean, man, imagine if your house lived, was by the cemetery. I, got, I, I definitely have no uh, no doubt. I'm gonna check this out. Um, the uh, Monk season three, Monk season one, Monk season four, Monk season two, and it's about a a guy with a OCD. Um, uh, you know, and he's a detective. That's got to be hilarious. Well, yeah, that's a great idea for a show or even a, a movie, but I guess a show would be more appropriate um, or, uh, con you know, um, better. Uh, so I want to check it out. I want to check it out, see how it is. Uh, I know they made the movie recently. It's on Peacock. So we'll check. We'll see. Uh, we'll see. There's got to be, it's got to be, it's got to be good. It's got to be good. There's, there's got to be a reason why they made the movie. Um, Scarface with Al Pacino. Uh, I've always heard of this film. I know, I know, I know. You're gonna, I, you know, and I call myself a movie reviewer and a movie lover and, and movie fanatic, and, and I haven't seen Scarface. Yes, I know. Uh, I've, I've always wanted to see this film. I, I like Will Ferrell. He's a good actor. He's funny, um, and I, I need to check this out for sure. I've never seen it. AVP, Alien vs Predator. There it is. That's the first one that came out. This is the one where the Predator ends up uh, making uh, friends with the the lead female actress at the end and then they end up fighting the alien and, and that was just to me what really and for a lot of people ruined the film I guess they thought it'd be scarier to have a mega a big piranha than a big shark or they want to see they, they, they want to see what happens when it's a if, if it is a mega piranha like mega piranhas are supposed to be very um aggressive I, I definitely see this one i think that this one has to is it is it kind of like jumper something or the name of that one but basically i think this is about something i think it's about time travel if i'm not mistaken but well, you know, we'll check it out. We'll see. The men who stare at goats. So the men who stare at the greatest of all times. So is that like me? I'm a football fan. So every time I watch uh, football, I'm, st I'm staring at the greatest of all times. Oh, no, no. Actually, this is no. This is uh, the men who stare at real goats. Goats. I, I got to I got to see this movie. I've heard Nebraska. Now, this is a film that I've been wanting to see for a long time. I mean, it was a cat. It was an Academy Award winner or well, nominee and then winner. Um, I have to check this movie out because of that, just for the sole fact of that. 
just because of the fact that it is an Academy Award nominee and, or was an Academy Award nominee and I believe it Academy Award winner. The King with Gael Garcia Bernal, uh, always in very interesting films, a really good actor, uh, makes us proud, and uh, and then he's he's acting alongside William Hurt. This should be great. William Hurt's a really good actor too. I wonder what it's about. I definitely this is this one's got my most uh, the most intrigue out of me than any of the other films, including Nebraska, ladies and gentlemen. But uh, oh, Blade Trinity. Oh, uh, but Wesley Snipes is also one of my favorite actors. I love him in Demolition Man. I love him in uh, Passenger 57. One of the best action stars ever. 